I'd like to comment on a recent paper that appeared in Science Advances, a peer-reviewed journal. The paper was written by Thomas Lovejoy and Carlos Nobre, and it's called Amazon Tipping Point, Last Chance for Action. And the paper concludes with this paragraph. Quote, we are scientists who have been studying the Amazon and all its wondrous assets for many decades. Today we stand exactly in a moment of destiny. The tipping point is here, it is now. The peoples and leaders of the Amazon countries together have the power, the science, and the tools to avoid a continental scale, indeed a global environmental disaster. Together, we need the will and imagination to tip the direction of change in favor of a sustainable Amazon." End quote. As much as I would like to believe that, the evidence points to the contrary. As I've been writing for many years, we are past that tipping point in the Amazon and many others. In fact, in my long essay at Nature Bats Last, Climate Change Summary and Update, which I updated periodically through the middle of 2016, I include papers going back to 2010 and through 2016 indicating that we were past the tipping point for the Amazon Basin, that we have already observed a situation in which more the respiration was overwhelming the photosynthesis, that is more carbon was being released from the Amazon than was being taken up by the Amazon, sometimes called the lungs of the planet, along with the coral reefs. So <clears throat> I don't see any way, and there are none mentioned in this paper, to return to a, quote, sustainable Amazon. I don't see any way, now that we have long passed the tipping point, I don't see any way that we can return to a situation in which more carbon is sequestered than is released from the Amazon. So I would love to believe that Thomas Lovejoy, who is a great scientist who's done work in the Amazon for decades, along with his co-author, Carlos Nobre, that they're actually correct about this. But I can't imagine they are. The evidence all points in the other direction. I think this is just another case of understating the obvious tipping point that was triggered long ago. At the edge of extinction, only love remains and a little bit of going halfway. <laughs>